Hey, what's up, guys? My name's John. Welcome to Daily Theology. Today, I want to talk about the upcoming presidential debate. Stay tuned for this because it's likely to be the topic most people are talking about across the country, probably even the world, uh, for the coming few days. So they're going to square off in an old put your dukes up style debate. Hopefully, there's no violence, but uh, I wouldn't be surprised if when people leave this debate that there's all sorts of chaos and anarchy in the streets. I assume one of the main topics is going to be uh, the Supreme Court nomination. Uh, it'd be interesting to see if Chris Wallace brings that up. He did uh, the debates in 2016. Let me play just a few clips here. It's a combination, Chris. Chris Wallace is no stranger to presidential debates or asking tough questions. Good morning, and welcome to Fox News Sunday. Since 2003, you've seen him on Fox News Sunday, ruling politicians. And I don't especially like asking you about this. I like this question. The campaign, and that has been your sometimes shaky performance on the campaign trail. One. So he says to Biden, you've had a shaky performance on the campaign trail. It'll be interesting to see how uh, Biden reacts to actual live people, live questions, and not being able to use the teleprompter. Also, it'll be interesting to see how measured Trump is in his responses and in his ability to act more presidential. There are people that really appreciate uh, dignity and uh, an ability to... Uh, Speak to people in a way that conveys uh, that you care about them and are not just flying from the hip or shooting from the hip. So all that to say, uh, the Bible says about these types of things that blessed are the peacemakers. In other words, happy will be those that try to reconcile. The ultimate mediator, the ultimate peacemaker, the ultimate one that speaks for truth and justice. Because remember, we should be concerned about truth in this debate. And when it comes to these issues... The idea of babies being uh, killed up to birth should be a very heavy decider for anyone watching this video and anyone voting in this debate. It is evil to kill a child. Now, uh, the Supreme Court will likely take front and center stage, but the Bible says that peacemakers are blessed. Well, Jesus Christ is the ultimate peacemaker. God made him who knew no sin to be sin. That means that every person has violated the law of God, but Jesus Christ fulfilled the law, and on the cross he bore the wrath of God for the sins of the people of God, which probably includes you because the comment section is likely to be a minefield on this one. But it's because people are so enamored with their own autonomous Uh, free will and uh, an ability to do whatever they want, that if anyone speaks against that and draws attention to a higher authority, which is God himself, the source of truth, love, knowledge, and grace, people get uh, get upset and get heated, but that's okay. Uh, I would encourage you to watch at least some of the recap of the debate to see what the issues are. Again, it's Tuesday night at 9 p.m. in Cleveland, so tune in and uh, check out some of the recaps if you can't do that, and don't forget to hammer that like button like the 95 Theses. Thanks for watching and God bless.